Do you sometimes struggle to interpret your performance data inside Google Search Console? Well, to make your analysis easier, Keywords Everywhere has introduced a new feature that will help you visualize your keyword data with brand new tables. These new tables can more easily uncover your best performing keywords and help refine your keyword strategy. Now, let me show you how it works. Make sure you have the Keywords Everywhere browser add-on installed and turned on, then log into your Google Search Console. In your performance report, you'll see this uh, usual line graph up here and also the table down below. Now, all of this data is very helpful to look at, right? Because you can see all of your website's top queries, but sometimes it's hard to get an easy grasp of what categories or buckets of keywords are performing best for your website, which is why Keywords Everywhere introduced the Visualize feature. So on the top here, you can see this Visualize button. Now, when you click on it, you can see some brand new tables below your line graph. So what Keywords Everywhere did was bucket all of your top queries to create these keyword analytics tables right over here. So this first one is the Keyword Clicks Tree Map. So from all of your top queries, these are the most common keyword modifiers that are driving the most clicks to your website. Now for this website, we can see here Essential. This keyword modifier drove about uh, 10 clicks over the last three months. Aside from clicks, you can take a look at the impressions. So out of the top queries, what are the top keyword modifiers that had the most impressions and also the actual raw count of your top queries bucketed by the keyword modifiers. So we could see here there are 492 keywords that have the keyword modifier of essential and we have 318 keywords that have the modifier of diffuser. So this gives you a nice overview of the types of keywords that are driving the most clicks, impressions, and also the number of keywords with these common keyword modifiers. So you can very easily see what topics on your website are performing the best. Now below the tree map, you can see these three bar graphs as well. So Keywords Everywhere analyzed uh, the top queries and it tells you how many keywords are in positions one through three, four to 10, so on and so forth. So as we could see here, uh, this website isn't performing too well in terms of keyword positions because most of the queries are ranking 51 or higher. And for this uh, CTR percentage, we can see how many queries have less than 1%, 1 to 3%, so on and so forth. And we can also see the impressions as well. So how many queries have impressions between 0 to 10, 10 to 100, so on and so forth over this given time period. And right now it is set at three months. So these bar graphs are very important because you can instantly see how your top queries are performing. And then this is the last section. This gives you more of the raw details showing you the keyword modifiers that are broken down um, by clicks, impressions, and the number of keywords your website ranks for, organized by the um, keyword modifier. This column here kind of acts as like a faceted navigation. So if you click into one of these keywords, you can see some additional keyword modifiers that are tied to this one. So if I click on maybe list, it drills down um, even further. So for example, if I click on chart, you can see the table updates. So this is the exact query. So list of essential oils and their uses chart. And for all of these queries, you can see the average monthly search volume, the average cost per click from Google ads, the competition score, and also the trend over the past 12 months. Now these four columns are only reserved and available for Keywords Everywhere paying subscribers. If you are on the free Keywords Everywhere, you will not have access to the data from these four columns, but you will have access to everything else because all of this data is pulled um, from the queries reports from Google Search Console. 
And you can also see the clicks, impressions, click-through rate, and the position. And these four columns do come from Search Console. It's essentially the same as the data that you see um, at the bottom right here. So this is very helpful because now you can very easily see just by looking at this list here, what modifiers or like topics are driving clicks to your website. So from here, you can decide whether or not you want to double down and maybe create um, more content around these topics. Or maybe if you see a topic that you've been working on quite a bit and it's not listed out right here, or it's kind of on the very bottom of this list, then what you can do is maybe figure out some new content strategies that focus on the lower performing topics so that maybe they can increase in rankings and drive more clicks to your website. So with these brand new visualization charts from Keywords Everywhere, you can more easily analyze the performance of your queries inside your Google Search Console. So if you enjoyed this video, make sure to smash that like button and also subscribe to our channel. If you wanna check out other videos, feel free to click any of the ones on the screen right now. Thank you.